Hi guys, this is Gloria. I want to give a warm welcome to each and every one of you for visiting my channel. Today we made this coconut cake. Here are the ingredients. First, you need to toast the fennel seeds and cardamom pods. When cool, you need to grind it. I usually take the outer covering off of the cardamom pod before grinding. Watch out, it's a nail breaking situation. Now let's grate the ginger and toast it slightly. Let it cool. Let the semolina toast in the same pan. My dates are chopped into small pieces. I'm adding baking soda with hot water, mixing it to the dates so it will soften somewhat. If you prefer it crunchy, you may skip this step. Grind the fennel seeds and cardamom seeds. Now I need the zest of lime, but I am out of lime, so I'm using lemon zest. Put the grated jaggery into a pot and cook on medium heat. I'm adding two tablespoonfuls of water because my jagger is kind of dry. Add the sugar and let it boil. Now add the spices, ginger, coconut, and stir well. Cooling the mixture on ice. Beat the egg whites with a pinch of salt until soft peaks form. While it's beating, let's prepare the pan. I am lining with parchment paper and greasing it well. Add semolina, flour, baking powder, to jaggery mixture and mix well. Then add the fruits and nuts. Let's add the flavoring. Here is how my mom used to measure. Look at these bottles. They are from Sri Lanka. Let's add the egg yolks with the whites now. Gradually add the eggs into the jaggery mixture and fold it in.
pour into the prepared pan and even it out well. Bake it at 320 degrees Fahrenheit for 45 minutes. Check for doneness by using a skewer or a toothpick. Please like and subscribe to Gloria's Platter and don't forget to hit the bell. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.